Hey everyone, it's Shane Lane. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be opening up another 25th anniversary rarity collection. I'm so hyped for this set. We're going to get so many new rarities. And uh, just to recap, I'm trying to finish my Mask Hero Dark Law collection. So far, we got the Super Rare, we got the Ultra Rare, we got the Ultimate Rare, and we got the Starlight Rare. So we're missing three rarities, and that is the Secret Rare, the Platinum Rare, and the Prismatic Ultimate Rare. Let's see if we can get those today. Let's go, guys. All right, guys, and we're back. Like I said, we're looking for that Dark Law, man. Dark Law is the key for this set for me. Um, but yeah, I mean, oh, let me let's see if we can get this focus. I think that's good enough. Hold on. Moving my mouse. Ooh. Starting off with the Platinum Rare. Nice. Here we go. Just gotta zoom out for you guys. A Nightmare Unicorn. I just actually realized this is an alternate uh, alternate art because of, of that one. <laughs> wow, did not notice that from the beginning. So we start off with the prison, uh, Platinum Rare. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. You know what uh, would have been insane about this? Oh, there's a Rota in here? This is the first time I'm seeing Rota. Okay, uh, we have the secret rare. Iris. Oh! Ultimate prismatic rare. Spell book of judgment. That's sick. And then keep in mind, these prices that I'm showing on screen are still, um, are still like pre, pre weekend. You know what I'm saying? So you, you won't really know the true market pricing until after the weekend because these, uh, this is set to release on Friday. Um, what was I saying? Oh, so you know what I made this set a little bit better is they added like more Albaz or or more meta like more today cards, you know what I'm saying? Ultimate rare. So like what was that? I have to add a cash or a flunder <laughs> or you know, just just to make it more relevant in today's meta, but I think I'll uh I think a lot of people oh secret rare lightning storm, that's cool. Oh, Ultimate Baron. Damn, that's nice. Sick. Oh, and an Ash Blossom. Even dude, This was a, a fire pack, man. Whoa, look at that. Yeah, that's an Ultimate Rare. Wow, so that rarity's higher. I'm just trying to organize this thing. And you know, um... The prices right now are kind of fluctuating. I see it, uh, but it's it's kind of like unreal to see it. <laughs> quarter century rare, dude. So when you open up a box, if you notice, I never shuffle my box. So I always open this. Side. I think this side has always been good to me. Um, so yeah, if and an ultimate rare inside one pack. Wow, dude, look at that. We got a savage dragon. This is a quarter century rare alternate art, by the way. This is cool. We're gonna move that off to the side. Wow, all types of rarities in here, man. And we got the ultimate rare Cyber Angel Ben 10. Looking nice. Maybe I should zoom that out a little. Um, wow. So I think the pull rates are three quarter century rares, three prismatic. Well, let me just. I don't want to like <laughs> lag out. You know what I'm saying? Well, not lag out, but take. Like I kind of want to get through this a little bit faster than I did last time. El Lich, Lone Fire Blossom as a secret. That looks actually nice. And the Ben 10, Change of Heart, Classic Ultra Rare from Metal Raiders. What was I saying? Oh, the pull rates. It's like three, three of each for the top one. And I think four Ultimate Rares, and then three Platinum Rares. That's that's like from comparing what I got last time. A forbidden drop of secret rare. Let me go. <laughs> Man, I'm about to finish the nightmare unicorn before I get Dark Law. But the collector, I mean not collector, ultimate prismatic ultimate rare, nightmare unicorn, and another Baron, and a Cyber Benton. So I don't know about the pull rate. I think I think this feels very, very diluted, you know what I mean? Um because it just seems because, you know, if you look at the value of, like, right now, compared to, like, the, like, you buy a box for, like, 90 bucks, that, let's say, let's say you buy a box for 90 bucks, and you're coming out with, like, 200 $300, that's kind of, 
Ooh, a Seeker Rare Ash. Cool. Another Rota. And Ice Prince Dragon. <clears throat> but, you know, it seems kind of unreal that every box you open is going to be like plus $300. You know what I'm saying? So, we just got to wait till the weekend's, weekend hit so we could uh, actually re evaluate. Oh my gosh. Another quarter century. Cold Talker Inverted. I don't even know if this is good or not. I'm, I think it is. And we have the Striker Dragon, Chaos Spear, and Nibiru. So yeah, I think uh, if you want to just go buy half a box, go go with the left side. Because <laughs> if you guys watch a few of my other, oh, okay, super rare. If you guys watch a, a few of my other videos, you'll notice that um, I'm I'm usually getting like first pack magic, which is which is kind of crazy. And it's, it's usually on the left side. So, wow, I pulled so many things on that side. <clears throat> more like half a box. So remember, oh, so I think I only have like one more chance to get a... Dude, Infinite Imper A Ferris? Secret Rare? This is crazy. Like, I'm... I'm like... In <laughs> I like looking at all these types of rarities. Like, it's just... I don't know. It's interesting because like it's affordable and you can always upgrade. You know what I'm saying? That looks pretty sick as a secret rare. Look at that. Look at that shine. Let me try to center it for you guys. Sorry, I don't know. I know I'm a little bit off centered. Um, it's because these packs are in the way. Let me move that up so that we can have a little bit more room. There we go. Trying to do this a little bit faster than uh, the last video. While we'll go on Tri Brigade Revolt. Interesting. Evenly matched ultimate prismatic rare. Prismatic ultimate rare, sorry. Looking good. I think I gotta zoom out for you guys. There you go. That looks good. Ooh, what decode. That's sick. So I think we're good on that ultimate prismatic rare. Um we're looking for one more quarter century if if the pull rates are right from yesterday. Chaos Sphere. Eldritch. I had an ultimate rare pot of prosperity. Looking good. I'm actually happy about this one. Triple tactics and a ancient fairy dragon. Looking for, I guess. So we're looking for two more platinum rares, one more quarter century, and one more ultimate. Here is a platinum rare. Magician salvation. Oof. I don't think we're gonna be doing any more, uh, any more of the dark laws unless I get a regular secret. And I'll, I'll call it a win if I, if I pull a regular secret dark law, um, just cause, uh, ooh, another ash. Like, dude, this is making like hand traps a lot more affordable because I know ash is like, kind of, it's, it's a staple. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody should have an ash. Oh, ultimate rare triple tactics. That looks clean, man, dude. Look at that. We're gonna we're gonna revisit it and then um look at all the high rarity stuff at the end of the video. So we're just pulling it out now just to see what we can get. So our pull okay. This is a regular secret rare. <laughs> and another ultimate not another, my first ultimate Celine. And wh what? Four? Barrier dimension dra I mean a dimension barrier? I don't know why I got dimension dragon in my head. Here we go. That looks pretty sick. Let me zoom out for you guys. So that's for that and for that. Can we get another platinum, platinum dark law, please? All the biz, Harold, and magician Ash Blossom. I'm just amazed that, <laughs> like, like you know, it's well. This one feels a little thicker. I remember last time we got thicker. It was a quarter century rare. So I'm, I'm thinking this is the same thing. So we're going to move one to the front just because I know that one isn't anything special. We have a Selene, a Compulse, a Dark Law Platinum. Here we go. <laughs> we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. This is exciting for me. Okay. We got that. We have the Herald. And we have the Selene. Okay. That's, that's, some, that's something. I, I'm going to say this is a win. I mean, we got oh, some pretty other cool things, but a, 
a platinum dark law that's to me that's a win even though it might be like three bucks in the future <laughs> i'm still gonna call it a win magician salvation alpha tropical revolt and ice barrier this one feels a lot thicker too you just after opening a few packs you'll just notice a difference when you when you pick them up You'll see what if you do, you'll see what I mean. And uh, maybe it just felt thick for no reason. Yeah, sometimes it do be like that. <laughs> it do be like that sometimes. Right, here we go. This one feels pretty good too. Reasoning. We got that one yesterday. Pot of Desires, a secret rare. <clears throat> Blue eyes, abyss dragon, and a pet of plant. A super effective. Wow. That's actually. I didn't really see that many effect fillers. Just like that's like my second one out of two boxes. And the other one I got was an ultra. Weird. Alright, try to get revolt. We have the Cyber Angel Ben 10. Small world. And the Cold Talker Inverted. Last pack magic. I'm gonna assume this is the quarter century rare because we only got two. But at the same time we got four Prismatic Ultimate Rare. So it kind of it's kind of throwing me off. We're gonna put one to the front just cause. Try to do some pack pack tricks. So the pet plant tour guide from the underworld. <laughs> Starlight forbidden droplets looking good, looking good. Here we go. Decode he soul talker and an Eldritch. Ended it off with a quarter century rare that looks pretty sick. So here's a recap of everything for the super rares. Um, I usually don't do recaps, but since these are like cards you can use and there's only like um There's only 81 82 cards you can have within this set So it's like yeah, why not because they come in all types of rarities and this is just something for you guys to look forward to if you guys plan to Shop for my TCG player side I try to be at least on the first page of everything for lowest price or the lowest price um, Just so I can help out Help out you guys because you know I was like that broke you know, player and I, I just didn't like that feeling you know I've win I won tournaments I've hustled this was my side gig when I was when I was playing but um yeah I topped eight a few times twice actually just not a few just twice and uh, yeah this was like my my side hustle you know this is how I ate <laughs> so here we go we have the here are the secret rares. Looking good, actually. Looking good. Like, I can't post these until Thursday night at 10 Pacific Standard because I guess, uh, I guess, what is it? TCG player works off of, um, in Central. So that's why. So Massacre of Dark Law, looking good. Old <laughs> Platinum Rare. We're, like, more than almost done. Salvation. Here we go. We got the Artifact Lancera. This is, this is an okay card. <clears throat> so, here we go with the Ultimate Rares. We have a Selene, Queen of Master Magician. Let me zoom out. There we go. That looks a lot better. We have the Triple Tactics. Dude, this looks sick. Look at that texture. You guys could just feel it. And we have the Pot of Prosperity. Uh, I think this is a good one. That looks sick. And Cyber Angel Ben 10. This is like a staple for one. Oh, I have one more. And a Baron. Oh, I can't believe I forgot about Baron. Ultimate Rare. Look at that shine. Very, very nice. Very, very. I like how they, the Ultimate Rare, they have like a, what is it called? Like a pearlizer on it. You know what I'm saying? Like it makes it like that matte metallic look. That per, I think it's called a pearlizer. Pearl. Here we go with the ultimate prismatic rare we have the dimension barrier okay card evenly matched uh this one might go for this one might be a higher value uh we have the nightmare unicorn very niche is not really a staple but it is a good one the alternate art by the way and the spell book of judgment looking sick and finally the quarter century rares forbidden droplet which is something i might actually keep uh, since it's a staple for for heroes and Cold talker inverted. I don't think this is I think it's okay It's still a quarter century and a nightmare unicorn alternate rare Dude now that I think about okay. No, 
whatever. I think I have this in my last video. I have to double check. But uh, there you go. There you have it. I'm going to be opening more. I'm trying to do another one for Friday. But we'll see how that goes. I don't think it's going to happen. But um, if anything, I'm going to be posting a video for Saturday. So I can post these. Like, I'm going to look on the, um, the market pricing. And then uh, put a discount out there for everything I have. Like, like, old, like platinum rare and up if, uh, if you guys are interested um for a discount compared to market value on tcg player i just i'm speaking a lot of information right now but but yeah if you if you guys are a former viewer i give out discount codes for for my ebay page so you could buy it buy cards at a discount so without further ado that is the set i plan to do more super excited we're almost finished with the massacre dark law and i can't wait to just have everything in my hands pause <laughs> <laughs> so don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and let me know what is your favorite card you saw within this set. And I'll see you guys later.